our students uh, have a hard time affording college or paying absurd amounts of money both for tuition and textbooks. Uh, and open education resources provide a way to eliminate some of that cost. Thing. When we began this project, it was really to save students money on textbooks. Textbooks are one of the places where it's so easy for faculty members to have an impact on costs for students right now. I remember before I was using OER, I would feel guilty if I would move into the second or third week of the class and my students were not prepared because they weren't able to buy the textbook. So the idea of open education with really focusing on affordability, focusing on access, focusing on driving toward better quality uh, solves the key problems that are kind of happening in the education sector right now. There is increasing pressure on institutions to address affordability issues for students. There have been escalating costs in higher education, and the textbook costs are a, a key component of the cost, especially for community college students. And when the students come into class and they don't have access to the required learning materials, they don't succeed. Open education resources are materials that offer freedom to educators because they're materials that we can revise, remix, redistribute, and really adapt to our teaching and our learning. Really, all we're referring to is some type of learning object. Text, video, um, images, anything that can be used to instruct that is free of traditional copyright. Open means two things. First, it means that uh, anyone in the world has free and completely unfettered access to the educational resources. Um, in addition to that access, there is a particular approach to copyright licensing. Open educational resources take an approach that says, some rights reserved. David Wiley and I have been working together on a couple of open educational resource projects. The Kaleidoscope Project, which is funded by the Next Generation Learning Challenges, and the Utah Textbooks Project, which was funded by the Hewlett Foundation. And in both of these grant-funded projects, the goal was, could we use open educational resources to really move the needle for success, especially with at-risk students? And the areas of success were improvements in student success, completion with a C or better in high enrollment courses. And in the Kaleidoscope project, we eliminated all costs for required textbooks and had the materials digitally available for free. Open educational resources have a big role to play both in improving affordability and in improving student success because there's a connection between affordability and success. Um, if I'm a student who can't afford my textbook, uh, and so consequently I don't have a textbook, I can't read the reading before I come to class, so I'm not prepared to hear what the instructor is going to say. And consequently, if I can't prepare appropriately and I can't practice appropriately with the homework problems and with my highlights and notes, Clearly, I'm not going to perform well on the assessments. Lumen's mission is to improve both access and student success through the use of open educational resources and analytics. And we really narrowed that down to two goals. For every course we touch, we want to eliminate 90% of the textbook cost. And every course we touch, we want to improve student success in the course by 10%. Lumen Learning provides all the support and the training and the help that an institution needs to begin using OER effectively. We needed the expertise that they, uh, that they bring to the table with um, the curation, uh, the training, uh, helping faculty feel comfortable that this in fact can be done. The impact I've seen on students because of the OER at Sully Community College, they're really getting the material, they're getting the math, they're engaging with the math and they're learning it. And um, myself and the two other faculty members who are teaching with OER this semester are noticing higher means on all of the tests and they're outperforming the non-OER classes. After reviewing our courses they were able to help us find additional resources and they were able to help us to uh, enhance our courses which was a great benefit. We help institutions bring together the right collection of open educational resources, the highest quality materials to support student learning that align with the curriculum of the institution. We support faculty members in both understanding the open educational resources and also evaluating over time how they might improve their use of the resources or the resources themselves. Lumen really has helped us negotiate these waters. 
They have provided us um, with many resources. They've held our hand through issues that we didn't even know were gonna come up. And so having Lumen help us with this has really been critical. My students are grateful every day for OER. And it, it's like a little party happened in my classroom when they found out that they didn't have to pay for textbooks. I think the impact for the student is much larger than just the dollars and cents. I think it is the impact that it makes college attainable and accessible um, and possible. <laughs>